It's this ball hard toward the right field corner, and it's going to drive in a run. Jonathan Villar will come home. Francisco Lindor gets the Mets rolling right away. An RBI double, and it's 1-0. Magnary Sierra is there to make the catch. Lindor's tagging this time. Sierra does have a strong arm. A close play, but the ball gets away, and it rolls toward the Marlins' dugout. It's going to bring home a run. Lindor will score as that ball not only got by the third baseman, Anderson, but John Curtis couldn't stop it either. Tomas Nito with a charge into this one, deep toward left center. That ball is off the wall. Dominic Smith on his way to third, being waved home. Relay throw heads toward the plate, not in time. RBI double, Tomas Nito. He's six for his last 11, and the Mets have a 3 1 lead. Marcus Stroman freezing Marlins in the fifth, the 1 2 3 inning. He strikes out the side. Cooper with a drive to left. This ball is deep, and it's gone. The game is tied on a Garrett Cooper two-run homer. Trevor May trying to quiet it right here. Tie game in the eighth. Base is loaded. The full count pitch. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Trevor May punches out Garrett Cooper. Throw to third, out! Oh. VR picked off by Adam Simber. Up the middle, there's the first hit for Hager. Dominic Smith goes to third, he'll be held. Get the baseball into the Mets dugout. Jake Hager has delivered his first big league hit. It's this ball hard down the line, toward the corner. It is a fair ball. Dominic Smith scores, and Khalil Lee with his first big league hit, his first big league contact, and his first big league RBI. It's four to three in the 12. Hit hard by Fargus to right. Diving attempt, it gets by Duval. Two runs will score. Janeshwi Fargus running around the bases. He might call the And a 6-3 lead for the Mets. High pop-up. It's playable for Cameron Mabin. And the Mets win in 12 innings tonight. A 6-5 battle in Miami.